Hello guys, my name is Hassan Abdullah and welcome to my YouTube channel. This is the first one of the workshop where we're going to the light to set up of distance and also get the IP render. So before starting that to make a few adjustments and light to set up, I always use that this layout to make a two part, right? is for the camera and left side is for the perspective now i'm going to lock it on the camera in the render setup on view to render i want to change it quad for very cam and lock this now let's make some adjustment in the ray tab i close that the uh, frame buffer and global switches in the image sampler tab i want to change it the bucket and me shading rate i want to change it to 24 and max up device is 210 and i'm going to also add the sum the render element at the light mix and ray denoiser okay now i want to change it the denoising engine to NVIDIA ID Noiser. Okay. Now, let's go to the top of the view and I start by creating a V-Ray Sun in the sun. You can find it right here. And I'm going to use the V-Ray Sun and let's just click, drag and drop it. Here. And we're going to use the V-Ray Sky for environment map map. So let's say yes. Okay, now in the perspective view, let's just uh, move the sun up to right around you, like this. Okay, okay, great. Now let's run the render to see what we have already. Yes. So I'm going to the render setup and added the over identical setting. I one click on it, to this bottom, and added the very empty light. And in here, the setting, I want to turn out the refraction. Okay, and this another render. Okay, let's add the an exposure. We're gonna have to reduce the higher burn. I want to add it. Uh, reduce and little bit more exposure in the sense. A little bit more. Increase that multiplier of environment. Two and three is okay. It's enough. I think, and a little again to reduce the highlight burn. Now, let's add it to some lights. I want to select this box and add it to some video lights in the box. Change it to a clay mode. Okay. The target going down a little. And other. And the last of that. It's okay. Now I want to add it, uh, another light under the disk box and the top of this TV wall. Let's do this. Now I want to rotate that light to target going to down and 
the copy of this we want to copy let's hide the seal and change to filter of the select to the light and I want to going up right around view and I want to rotate that to top it's okay and I want to increase the length of this light now it's better a little bit more I see that. And I want to go into camera and unhide out everything and get the, another render. The CDs and in the option, I want to turn it on the invisible and other this and this light okay and in the lightness element i want to change the multiplayer and the temperature of the this light we light four is four of them pi 10 is better and in the color of the, this light, I want to change it with the Kelvin to 3000. It's okay. The same. The tavern. And going up the multiplier of this light. It's okay. And this. they'll reduce that and I want to add it to some IS light for this halogen so let's add it change filter to all and I want to add here yes it's here you can find it Click, drag, and drop. Okay. Above the view, I can see that. This side. Target. Button of the this. And here. I should move down this slide. Okay. And right click on this select the light target moving down on the floor and copy of this to here it stands and another here it's okay and we are going to add it the is find here okay and get the other rendering And now you can see that the video is 03. And uh, I want to increase that the multiplayer to 10 and change the temperature to 3000. You can see that. And this is the environment. I can't. Two five is okay. A little bit more. Fifteen. And I want to say the one trips about the villain light. In this modify, we have a rectangle this light option and directional. I want to increase that from the zero to five. 
0.5 you can see that when you change we have a more light on the piss box now you can see it's so amazing and let's uh, get the render and you can see that the lighting setup of this sense and we can add it uh, some mesh light in the halogen I want to isolate that three light before that I want to attach this should uh, make a unique of this before that and now I want to add this light and another and use the element of this light and detach make it detach and I want to create the mesh light and give that light to the this plane of this mesh light and pick mesh you can see that and go to the camera and get another hyper render with a camp on now you can see that and change the temperature like this and increase the little bit more that light too high this is okay the final hyper render see the overall of this sense and now you can see I hope you like it and enjoyed with the, this video and please like this video and leave a comment if you like thank you or watch this video to end of it and and have a good time.